Morning everyone. We're heading off Napier today and I've got the two Jasons from Manawatu. We're out looking for a kingfish mostly and whatever else turns up. We've got a pretty good forecast this morning. Five knot variable in the morning but we're going to have a look at it coming out the channel. But yeah I'm just honestly keen to get stuck into a few more fish and hopefully we can get onto a king. We're now out on the reef with the jig out waiting to go when we see some sign. I did see a big school of something just then, but I don't think it was kingfish. It looked like bait, possibly kahawai, high in the water column. But we're just mapping out the main parts of the reef. Pretty easy for us to see where all the pins are after I've done a bit of a paddle around today. It's fairly lumpy out here this morning, but nothing we can't handle. Me and the guys are just hoping that it'll calm off and we can have a nice couple of hours before it picks up again in the afternoon. But we're gonna stick at it, see if we can't find these kings. You might want to come over here. <laughs> yeah, it's well legal. Tails hanging out, good. Yep. First king of the season. Yep. Now I've got to get a big one. I pulled him in real quick, eh? I locked up on him, expecting for it to try and waste me. Yeah, I locked up on him. Yeah, but bit further that way. It was between the red boy and the black one. Yeah, and a little bit up. They were um, sitting on top of the rock, and then they were then there were a bunch of them off the other side of it. I don't see them now. Can you see them? But definitely not where I first saw them. Now though, as soon as I see them, I'll tell you. Yep, they're under me.
Only a couple though, not heaps. Right, Jace, we'll keep going and try and find them again. Bit of an update for everyone. We've now been out for a few hours. Mapped out quite a bit of the inner Pania rocks. And we've caught our first king of the season. Only a little one at about 90 centimetres. Welcome for the table though, so I've chucked them in the back. Haven't seen any sign of any more skulls after that first one, which is very odd. I was expecting to catch up with it again after I jigged the fish out of it. Um, nothing. So, we've exhausted all of the, the reef there pretty much. So we're going to jump out onto the more populated part of the reef. There's plenty of boats out there, but it's worth a shot, I think. Bait's getting eaten. Hopefully it's not a cooter. He's on there. Rolling. We're on. Could be a dory actually. Don't tell me it's a door. Oh, it's a coda. Ah, bloody codas. So we've done all of our paddling for the day, apart from going home. We've done all of our kingfish fishing for now. There really aren't that many here at the moment. We did find one school in close and I talked to some sparrows on the reef and they shot a couple as well, but they weren't big. They were 10 to 12 kilo and not that many, but I mean, they did say that the school was about 50 fish, but obviously they've buggered off and gone elsewhere. So now what we're going to do is, well, we've just anchored off the edge of the reef, probably off the reef by about 100 or 200 metres. And now I'm going to pump a mean burly trowel, put three kilos of it into the water, see what we can bring in. Just did have a livey eaten by, well, I assume it was a barracuda. But um, this burly will get going. I'll catch another couple of live baits, hopefully, and uh, maybe a couple of bottom fish too. I, um, I thought I thought there were kingfish behind that car wire, but then I looked and they were silver. Yeah. They um, they usually bugger off as it gets hotter, but obviously they're still staying. Oh, that's a perfect bait. Why do they? Oh! <laughs> yeah. Boof! Oh, you got it again. <laughs> 
<laughs> Boof! He got it! <laughs> Holy shit, that scared me! Let's go! We're on our way back in now. Just stopped off at my 10 meter spot. Wasn't anything hanging out there apart from a few mackerel. Towed the livey all the way into there and had him down for about an hour on that spot too. So we had another opportunity to hook another kingfish, but obviously they aren't in here at the moment. Weather's actually calmed down a little bit compared to what it was like earlier. Looking forward to getting back to shore.